how exciting the game was and how disappointing it was to come up short? Yeah, you know, um, running out there at the beginning was fun. You know, we played pretty well throughout the whole game. And then, you know, it's super disappointing at the end there to come up a little bit short. I mean, we played great pretty much the whole game. Super disappointing. Did you have some nerves at the beginning? Well, everybody, if you just raise your hand, and we'll uh, point you out so we don't talk over each other. Jarrett, how would you assess your play specifically? How do you think you did out there? Um, a lot of stuff I can do better. I mean, I had a few nice passes, a few good plays, but there's a lot of stuff I could do better. You know, with reads, um, had some mess ups, you know, had some bad luck, but that's no excuse. I just got to stay sharper and get a little bit better. I wonder if you had some nerves at the beginning, how it was the first couple of snaps. Yeah, I mean, I, I, there was a little bit of nerves, but I got over it really fast. I mean, got my first completion in, got our first touchdown in, and I was over it pretty fast. Can you talk about the decision? I'm not sure if it was planned beforehand to have Coach Franklin on the sideline with you. A lot of times coordinators will be in the booth. What went into that decision, and how did that help you throughout the game? Uh, yeah, it was helpful. He, he made that decision, I think, earlier in the week, and it was it was very helpful having him there, you know, being able to talk to me directly, you know, in between plays and stuff like that was definitely very helpful. Would that be a season-long thing, or was it special for the first game? I don't know. You'll have to ask him that. I'm not sure what he's going to do. Is Big Lil hurt? No. Not that I know of. Third quarter, you guys came out on fire. They went 15 for 19 for over 200 yards and those two, two TDs to Harper. What was said in the locker room or what was changed that kind of helped you guys come out a little quicker? I don't think anything. I mean, we didn't really make too many adjustments. We knew that uh, we were going to get the post to Chris. We knew that was going to be there. And I mean, that was really, I mean, that was really it. We came out, you know, just did what we've always been doing. You know, we don't really think about the score too much, think about anything else. We just do what we always do and, you know, it worked out pretty well in that third quarter. Uh, what were your thoughts on the string of uh, second half injuries by Northwestern? I'm not going to talk about that. <laughs> Jerry, was this an encouraging performance, do you think, for your team? Definitely. I think, um, you know, we, we definitely played well throughout most of the game. I mean, the ending there was a little disappointing. But, you know, we've got a lot to build on now with uh, how well we played. You know, we learned a lot of stuff. You know, just everything, everything that could have happened kind of did happen throughout the game and, um, you know, we learn from it and we'll come out stronger. Brother back here. Jared, maybe not necessarily the injury specifically, but do you feel like the rash of injuries did affect your rhythm? It shouldn't have. You know, it, it may have a little bit affect the offensive rhythm, but it shouldn't. We should just be able to work right through that. Uh, what are your thoughts on McCain's ejection? I didn't see it. I didn't see the hit. I didn't see uh, the replay. I don't know. Anything else for Jerk? Okay. Oh, we got one down here. Uh, after throwing the ball 63 times, you know what is so much different about doing something like that as opposed to what you were doing in high school last year? I didn't even know I threw it that many times. Um, that I mean, it's it's more than I threw in high school, but it didn't really feel like that much more. I was just going through my reads and you know just throwing the ball when I was supposed to, handing it off when I was supposed to, and you know just happened to work out like that. Uh, that last interception, uh, you didn't see the safety coming over. What, what happened on that one? Just threw a bad ball. You know, it was it was open. I just I just can't put that much air under it. Just got to throw it on the line. It was it was there. I just made it, made a bad pass. After one game under your belt, what do you think is the potential of this offense for the rest of the season? I'm I'm really excited for our offense. I mean, that was that was a lot of fun out there, and you know, obviously didn't work out the way we wanted it to, but. You know, it, it, it's it's a very fast tempo, and you guys can see there in that third quarter how how much rhythm we can get and how well we can just start rolling, and you know that can happen at any time. And you know, I'm super excited for it. So I can do it. Okay, thanks. I want to coach Doug here in just a minute. Thank you.